that economies cannot thrive when workers barely earn enough to make ends meet. And finally, my last five reasons that we need a minimum wage, my friends, it's the right thing to do, it's fair, it's principled, it's progressive, and it's exactly what we need to do to strengthen communities like Oshawa all across Ontario. Uh, because a $15 minimum wage would just get people over the poverty line. And we want people, no one should be working full time and still living in poverty. No one should be living in poverty, but definitely not those who are working full time. So we need $15 to get that work started, but the work will always continue. They know who they are, but they are precarious workers. They are racialized workers. They are women. They are youth. They are single parents. I'm here fighting for uh, 50 in fairness because workers need it, and we're here to support the workers that need it. The workers who are affected by the substandard minimum wage, what they're making, how hard they're working, and if it's just that they live below poverty. <laughs> deserve a living wage as it stands. The minimum wage in Ontario is not a living wage, so a $15 minimum wage would go a long way into bringing people out of poverty, especially women and racialized people and families dealing with children. Minimum wage workers aren't just students looking to make some extra cash. They're people with uh, families and they're people who deserve a decent standard of living. So Right, there's so many things I can spoke to that joining a union. Well, that's you know, yeah, sick pay. Yeah.